This is B. N. N. And welcome to the first day of seven days of Smog Monster. Smog Monster, also known as Hedera, is an enemy of Godzilla who made his debut in Godzilla vs. Hedera, in 1971, which was released theatrically in the United States in the spring of 1972 as Godzilla vs. the Smog Monster. Godzilla vs. the Smog Monster is universally agreed to be one of the strangest Godzilla films ever made. The film was notoriously controversial after its inception, so much so, that the director was forbidden from ever making another Godzilla movie. Anyway, Smog Monster's design is obviously inspired by a pillow covered in tar, and I'm sure there is a metaphor behind Smog Monster's design that I'm just not getting. The film had a strong anti-pollution message with the director being inspired after visiting a polluted beach. The film includes cartoons, LSD trips, hippies, and a flying Godzilla, all of which easily makes it a contender for being the boldest Godzilla film ever to make it to the big screen. Most people who are not fans of Godzilla are not fond of the film. The US dubbed version was featured in the 1978 book The 50 Worst Films of All Time. The reception by Godzilla fans is mixed. Personally, I enjoy it, but wouldn't put it in my top 5. On an interesting note, back in 1985, Roger Ebert cited it as his favorite of the Godzilla films. Another random fact, Smog Monster appears on the album cover of rock legend Frank Zappa's Sleep Dirt. Anyway, this ends day one of seven days of Smog Monster. Tomorrow we will talk about Godzilla vs. the Smog Monster 2. The sequel that could have been but never was. This has been BNN. And we thank you for not smoking.